Some Democratic and independent senators introduced a bill allowing ICE to secure judicial warrants to arrest undocumented immigrants who are charged with violent crimes. The move comes amid a debate over the migrant crisis at the U.S. southern border ahead of the 2024 election. Three of the bill's sponsors are up for re-election. They include Democrats Sherrod Brown, Tammy Baldwin, and Bob Casey. Senator Chris Murphy of Connecticut argued the bill is needed, saying... Even though we know immigrants are less likely to commit crimes than Americans, it is also true that there are times when ICE needs to take custody of a non-citizen accused or convicted of a serious crime. Currently, ICE issues so-called detainer requests to local governments to hold undocumented immigrants arrested by local police, but not all jurisdictions comply with the request. By allowing ICE to request judicial warrants, the bill looks to guarantee their detention by federal authorities. Murphy says the Democratic proposal is different from those of some Republicans, which aim to ban sanctuary cities or allow local police to detain any person suspected of being an undocumented immigrant. The National Republican Senatorial Committee accused the bill's sponsors of simply using the legislation as a political tactic.